Jordan, what was the, the reaction like from the guys when, when Coach came in and made the announcement? Yeah, it's, uh, it's exciting, man, uh, to get the opportunity to play one more game together and to go to a great location like Phoenix. It's an honor to be invited to play in the Cheez-Its Bowl. Just kind of as a whole, with making a bowl game one of the goals, what does it mean for the program and for you guys? It's awesome. Uh, just to get the, like I said, to get the opportunity to play one more game together, and that's one of our goals is not to only go to a bowl game, but to win it. So now uh, we've got a great opponent in TCU, and we're going to be prepared when it comes to, to go accomplish that goal of winning the game. Cal and TCU have never faced off before. What's it going to take to make sure that you guys get to eight wins, and uh, how does the three weeks of preparation help you guys? Yeah, uh, TCU's uh, been a traditional great football team. They have a great program. They have a great uh, culture there and coaching staff and Coach Peterson, or Patterson, rather. And, um, yeah, it's, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a dogfight. I mean, that's really how all of our games have been this year. Um, we had to fight and claw and uh, scratch our way to victory, so uh, I don't think it'll be any different. And we're going to use these three weeks to – get better as a program to take care of our bodies and, and uh, prepare hard for a good TCU team. On, on top of prep for the bowl, this is also a good time for the young guys to get reps and development. Do you say anything to, to those guys about you know how to approach these weeks of practice? Yeah, I, I'll for sure uh, talk to the linebackers, some of the defense players, and um, just encourage them to really take this time seriously because it's it's really awesome that they get the opportunity to develop more because this is something that Cal hasn't had um, in, since 2015. And it's just, it's, it's an opportunity. It's, it's just like having another spring ball. You know, you make a lot of strides in spring ball. And for the young guys who have been on scout team all year and they get limited reps and developmental on Mondays for them to go out there and have the opportunity to practice and they're going to, have a lot of, I assume they're going to have a lot of reps um, going against each other. It's going to be, um, it's going to be really good for them. So I'll, I'll stress to them the importance of taking this serious. And we have a great group of young guys, and I don't think they would mess around anyways. They're very serious and committed to the program and getting better. Do you get a, a sense from being around the guys that this is kind of becoming the standard that you guys expect to be here on, on the last day of the season and, and to be finding out where you're going to play in the postseason? Without question. And that was one of our – the first goal we set is to, to win a bowl game. So um, that's the expectation. The expectation is not only to win a bowl game but to, to accomplish other goals. And unfortunately, we weren't able to do that this year. But um, it's really an honor and a blessing to get the opportunity to um, – go to a bowl game and to go to a great location like Phoenix and play a really good opponent. So I'm excited. I know the guys are excited and um, it's, it's, a, it's a good time.